Hi guys and welcome along to today's video. I was asked the other day what was the feed pipe into the radiator which was the right one to turn for a single pipe system. And that got me on to thinking that maybe a few of you might like to know what one single pipe system heating is. But anyway, let me show you on a drawing what I'm talking about here. Basic drawing in, very basic <laughs> of a one pipe system. And you can see the feed in is, is gonna be basically that the closest one coming from the flow of the boiler as it goes around there that will be the feed in there it's going to be the hot one that will be the one in there and that one there what happens with these one pipe systems they just literally drag the heat through the radiator as it were it gets kind of pulled if this pipe was too far away from the radiator it, it wouldn't actually work um, it wouldn't be able to do it so you'll find this one pipe usually runs under the rad or just under the floorboards and you just have the one pipe going right around the house chin off to all the, the valves but if you've got like two valves which you will have but are not thermostatic on one end they're just a the fixed turn type then you can turn the heating on, have a feel which one gets hottest first, this side or that side, if you're not sure because the pipe might be under the floor, you don't know if it's running this way or this way. Uh, so therefore, just put your hand on either end and feel which one heats up first. But as I say, that one there would be the flow in, but it doesn't really matter. You can adjust your balance by doing this one here. Okay, it doesn't matter, it's going to have the same effect, it's going to stop the flow going through that radiator and along. Okay, so it's not, not a hard one, that one, it doesn't matter which one you turn. It will have the same effect and obviously the same if you want to just turn the radiator off, it doesn't matter if you turn that one or that one. Obviously if you've got a thermostatic rad valve on there, just turn that one. It doesn't matter these days whether that thermostatic rad valve is on the flow or the return now. Um, it, did do a few years back because they never worked if they were fitted on the returns if you had one there it would never work it would bang and clatter and do all sorts so quite a good giveaway if you've got thermostatic rad valves on there they are generally on the flow going in okay the hotter pipe that's going in and that's another way obviously to tell because generally this one and this one you put both hands on there when the heating was on but this one should be hotter than the one coming out all right, and that's about it for a one-pipe system. That's it then. Just a little heads up on that one I was asked about. Uh, that's about it though. Usual place for all my stuff. Nowhere to go. Derrick and 33. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.